Hello, I hope you are doing well. In this video, we are going to introduce you uh, partial differential equations and how you can solve these kind of equations. As I said before, uh, in ODEs, uh, we have just uh, one independent variable, but in uh, PDEs, we can have uh, we have more than one. Uh, independent variable. This independent variables uh, can be be uh, directions x, y, z in Cartesian uh, coordinator uh, coordination, uh, and uh, it uh, can be time in time dependent systems. So uh, I select model wizard and I select two D, and I want to solve some classical. Uh, partial differential equations. There are some well-known equations in uh, engineering and scientific words. The I select heat equation, for example. You can choose each of them based on your need and based on your uh, model. Uh, if you click on a study and uh, select time dependent, for example. So I draw geometry. The rectangle with 10 and 10 okay uh, and uh, here in this part uh, I can see the heat equation uh, you see there is no property uh, so I define the boundary condition for my system I define there is a boundary condition in this part that is 500 degrees degree Kelvin and a boundary condition that is 298 Kelvin okay the initial values for the first time is ambient temperature and it is our equation and how we solve this kind of equations okay so here uh, we have uh, one, two, and three parts of our equation. The first time is our system is time dependent, and it is one. Uh, and uh, the coefficient i of c is one, two, and term of f is the amount of energy that uh, produced in the system. I selected zero. So after meshing and computing it is a temperature distribution uh, alongside of our solid geometry and uh, you can see that uh, this equation have been solved for this purpose uh, but uh, there is other ways, there is other module, modules that you can solve your equations but because sometimes you need works on your uh, specific uh, equation you must uh, use this kind of uh, actually modules okay so it is a temperature distribution I showed extracting data in one of this section uh, and I draw a line here from this point to this point the x is 0 to 10 and y is 5 and 5 it is a line and I name it y equal 5 it's just a name okay and I select right click on this graph right results one plot groove one d plot groove line graph and I select this one and I extract my variables okay I can activate uh, legends for my system and I can see uh, the variables lying side of time which is length in different times temperature profile in different times 